Okay, YouTube, this is Michael Bell back again from Tart Performance, and today we're going to reassemble that uh, front end and put that front tire on and mount the calipers and whatnot on here. And uh, kind of going to be a short video. I'm starting to get this garage taken care of, and uh, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. My subscriber numbers are kind of getting up there a little bit if you're if you're watching these videos somebody's watching all these videos if, if you really hit that subscribe button it really helped me out uh I, I i started researching on and on about this youtube thing and it's all about thumbs up and subscribers and you know they limit your content if it doesn't reach certain amount of people within a certain amount of time and the analytics and the the AI intelligence on these videos is just unreal. I mean, I, I, I could get on here and talk about Kim Kardashian's ass and Donald Trump and, and Kanye West all day, but uh, you know, I kind of want to focus more on the motorcycle thing. So uh, appreciate you watching and we're going to get into this. It's going to be a little shorter of a video and uh, don't forget to watch next week. Um, I really wasn't sure I was going to put this video on for next week. Uh, I'm going to get into the exhaust system a little bit. I'm ahead of myself on, on the video, so I've got some recorded content that's keeping me a couple of videos advanced every week. Um, but I, I did have this motorcycle fall off of the, the front triple tree mount when I was taking the exhaust off. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and show that in the outro next, next week. So don't forget to watch that. I've, I've never had that happen before in my life, and I got real, real lucky on what it damaged. But uh, yeah, so. Uh, Enjoy! Okay, we're going to reinstall this tire here. Make sure you have your bolt. Um, go ahead and I already put a little thin layer of grease on it. And make sure your bolt's going to go in the correct way. And then we're going to install the tire. And the tire actually has a mark on it that is going to tell you which way that the tire rotates so you get want to get it in there the, the correct way and don't forget your spacer that goes on the rim there so we'll go ahead and get this in there Okay, so we got the tire in there. Then you want to thread your nut on the end of that bolt. I'm going to have to go inside and see what the correct torque spec is on that. We'll go ahead and tighten these bolts back up on the bottom to hold the bolt in. What you want to do is you want to tighten the side that doesn't have the nut on it because you're going to have to hold the bolt still. Well, you tighten the other side.
Actually, we're going to go ahead and mount these. Uh, break. Well, I was going to put new pads on them, but we're not going to mount that yet. Just make sure all your discs are spread apart. Hopefully you were smart enough not to press the brake lever while you was doing all this. I might have to spread that out because these discs actually have a little more padding or uh, surface than the old ones. So I'm going to have to spread these out. Okay, I've got those spread back out. And you're just going to put your two bolts back on. Hopefully, everything will go together like it should. Sometimes these can really be a pain in the butt. got that all spread out there so we'll go ahead and put this back on real simple just got your two bolts I'm really wanting to get this motorcycle off of this triple tree stand fell off. I'll just go to the other side and do the same thing. Now hopefully here we're going to get this thing off of this goddamn jack stand. I'll tell you what, I've actually sounds like I've got one pad that's that's dragging on here and it's not allowing that tire and it's all over here on this right side it's not it's not applying pressure but it's I can hear it dragging I'll kind of address that when I go to change the pads but this little stand here I will probably never use that thing again just remember to go back and torque all your bolts back to spec so let's see if I can get this thing down I had it all strapped up over on this other side I've already had this thing fall once. I don't want to fall again, for God's sake. Whoopee, thank God. Somehow I managed to get a, a, a bee, a, a colony of bees. It's just turned into spring, and I've got bees in my garage everywhere. And that, I mean, I'll tell you what, the only way I can think of getting rid of them is to suck them up. I just, just hate these little cocks. 